Welcome to State of Tech. Let's take a look at how multitasking and multi-window apps work on your Note 8. So with multitasking, if we hit our Recents button, it'll show us all the applications that we have recently opened. Currently, I don't have any, but let's go ahead and open a few so we can see how this works. So I'm just going to launch a few different apps. We'll even come into our app drawer and open up a couple more just for good measure. So now that we have a few different apps open, we'll go ahead and hit our Recents button, and we can see all of the cards for all of the apps that we have open. Now I can swipe through and say I wanted to jump back into my camera, just come to the camera card, tap on it, and it opens up the camera again. Now if I tap on the Recents button, I can see all of my other recent applications. So let's say I want to now open up the Play Store, I'll tap on Play Store. Now that we're in an app, let's say that we wanted to quickly jump into the application we were recently just in. In this case, our recent application was the camera, so now if I double tap on the Recents button, it'll open the camera. And if I double tap the Recents button again, it's going to bring me back into the Play Store. So this can be really cool if you're trying to hop in between a couple different social media apps, say like Facebook and Twitter. You can use those applications and just go ahead and quickly rotate between them by tapping on the Recents button twice really quickly. So now what we're going to do is go ahead and tap and hold on the Recents button. And what this is going to do is open the multi-window view. So now it's put Google Play uh, Store up at the top of the screen. And now we can see all of our recent apps and we can tap on one of those and open it down below. So now I have two different applications open at the same time. As you saw here, we had some on-screen controls. If I tap in, in the middle of the section, I can actually switch which app is on the top and which app is on the bottom. The current app that's selected kind of has an outline around it. So right now that is Google Play Movies. I can tap on the full screen and kind of give me a different screen mode. So now if I tap in there, what I can actually do is make this an actual pop-out. So now Google Play is now a pop-out and I can go ahead and adjust this wherever on the screen. I can even close it by hitting the X. And now my Google Play Movies is just full screen. Tap and hold on the Recents button and it brings me back into my multi-window. And then we'll go ahead and tap on another app. So now that they're open, you see Google Play is the one selected because the outline is around it. And if I tap on the actual Google Play Movies, the outline goes around that one, and that is my selected application. So now if I tap in there, I can actually snap the window. So if I wanted to make it a little bit smaller, I'll tap Done. And so now I have that window snapped up there. So now that window is snapped, what I can also do is tap and hold on the divide right here, and I actually readjust the screen real estate here based upon the apps. So now when I let go, all my screens are going to kind of resize and give me that proportion based upon where I put the slider. And if I tap in the middle again, the selected application that I have open, tap the X, it'll close that one and give me the full screen one for the one that was on top. And if I tap and hold from here, back into my recents list. And my apps list will show me all of the applications that I have on my device that are available for multi-window. Obviously the one that's currently open is grayed out because I can't have that one open twice. So I would need to select a different application and go ahead and have that open here in the Recents view. And tapping on the Recents will just show me now all the multi-window apps that I have available based upon that real estate. If I tap and hold on the Recents, it'll just open up the application that I have on the top and give me that one full screen. And then hitting my Home button now will bring you back out to my home screen You'll also notice in the Recents panel, if we tap on that, we can see all of our different cards. All of them have an X and kind of a multi-window button as well. There is also one here on the Play Movies TV that we can actually have that snap to a screen. So we'll go ahead and give it a certain screen real estate, and we'll tap Done, and it's going to snap that portion to the screen and allow me to open up a different multi-window app. Now hitting the Home button, you see everything's been minimized. And if I tap on my Recents button, it'll open up the two applications that I had in my Recents panel. To get rid of this mode, tap and hold on the Recents button, and it brings you back to a full screen application instead of bringing you back into kind of my Recents multi-window. So that's how you use multitasking and multi-window applications on your Galaxy Note 8. For more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to State of Tech. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video, and we'll see you in the next one.